So Lisa bought 57 kilograms of flour and 22 kilograms of sugar to bake some cakes. For each cake, the amount of flour used was 5 times the amount of sugar required. After baking 8 such cakes, there were 4 kilograms of flour and some sugar left. So part A is asking how many kilograms of flour were used to bake one cake. So since we know that there were 4 kg of flour left, the amount that she used would be 57, subtracting off the amount left. So we know that she used 53 kg of flour to bake the 8 cakes. So if 8 cakes took 53 kilograms to, to bake one cake, they will be taking 53 kilograms dividing by 8. So that will give us answer for part A, which is 6.625 kilograms of flour per cake. Alright. So we know that the amount of flour used was 5 times the amount of sugar required. So to find the total amount of sugar that she used uh, for each cake, they will be taking 6.625 dividing by 5. And we have the amount of sugar used, which is 1.325 kilograms for each cake. But to find how much sugar was left, we must find the total amount of sugar used for all 8 cakes. So we will take this amount which is the amount of sugar required for each cake multiplying by 8 since she baked a total of 8 cakes. So multiplying by 8, we will have 10.6 kilograms of sugar used. Since she had 22 kilograms at first, and she used up 10.6 kilograms, the amount of sugar left will be 11.4 kilograms. But question demands our answer to the nearest kg. So we'll round it off. Since it's 0.4, we'll round it down and we'll have 11 kilograms that's our answer for part B.